Hello and welcome back to my channel. This is Early Career Academic. On this channel, I explore how I use the Passion Planner to set personal and professional goals. In this video, I'm going to be planning out the week of, I believe it is January 8th through the 12th or 13th. <laughs> well, obviously I need a plan, so I don't know what days are next week. Still getting used to the Monday start um, because my brain was just like trained on the Sunday from last year, but I changed it up to Monday, so here we are. Before I get started, I am a Passion Planner Ambassador. There is an affiliate link in the description of this video and a discount code if you'd like to pick up any Passion Planner goodies. Um, they do have a lot of new stuff from the launch in the fall, so take, take a look at that if you are interested. This is the medium size marble cover Passion Planner. Not new by any means, but a very big fan favorite, myself included. Um, this is undated. All the months are in the front and all the weeks are in the back and then the blank pages are in the very back. So I'm excited to share with you um, how I am setting up my 2024 planner. If you haven't had a chance yet to look at my setup video and my roadmap video, those are available to you. And then next week you will actually get my January plan with me. So a lot of exciting stuff happening on this channel. Okay, so we're flipping to the new week. Let me move my little typewriter out of the way. Um, and it is the 8th. Let me go ahead and jot the dates in. This is, as I said, undated, so you have to jot the dates in or we'll put date stickers. They do have date stickers if you're interested. I just like to write them in because they create little bumps at the top over time. So through the 14th is the dates that we're working with here. Um, so today I'm going to be using stickers from the New Year New Goal sticker book. I know you've seen this in a few of the videos so far. Um, it's apropos and it is a new year after all. Um, but I'm trying to use these stickers in ways I have not used them before. So that's the challenge I'm setting for myself. So this time I'm going to use some of the stickers from this page. Honestly, this page mystified me for a long time. Like I'm like, how am I going to use these stickers? But now I've had a brainstorm and I'm going to use some of them in this week's spread. And then I'm going to pull some stickers from here because I think the brown, it's kind of a brown red color would work well with this color combo of stickers. And then I'm going to bring in some of this like specialty washi that I got on Amazon. Um, probably one of the browner looking ones to kind of go along with the sort of like brown, pink, yellow combo that we're working with for this week. <coughs> this coming week is actually fairly, it's not like it isn't busy, busy, but it, there's definitely less like smaller things happening in this week. Um, let's go ahead and do, let's do this washi. This one has like a combination of colors in it once you unsplit. So we're gonna do that. Okay, I found the edge. Let me go ahead and get myself ready for washi. Um, so there's fewer like scheduled things, thankfully, this coming week. Um, although since we're in the in the like process of you know settling into our new home and repairing some things we knew about beforehand. Um, there's definitely stuff that has popped up over the course of this past week for sure. Um, but, you know, just nice that the week is a little bit fairly open until Friday, then we have a big, a big-ish um, trip planned for us. We're going to North Carolina to visit my friend for her daughter's fourth birthday. Oh, dang. That's why she is tearing. Let's get rid of that. Okay, let's see if I can do this without losing my mind. We will see. This is kind of older washi, so maybe, maybe it's going to challenge me. All right, let's see if we can do this. Ugh. This is very frustrating, y'all. I just feel like the edge got caught or melted or something and it's going to be perpetually plaguing me with this issue. I could make it really like rough, you know. Okay. 
Okay, I like this bit of the washi. We're gonna we're gonna be a little bit of a washi waster <laughs> because of the way that this washi is coming off the roll, but it's okay. I have plenty to spare. All right, we're gonna put that and then we'll see if we can get another good swath. like this okay I know you're like oh my gosh that's so much washi you're cutting off but <laughs> it uh, it is what it is this tape is not functioning correctly okay so I think that looks super cute and it's gonna go well with the stickers I think when I get them on there so let me go ahead and put what plans I know I have in here and Let's just see. I just want to take a quick look at my my options here. Let's put this little, let's use one of these flags. I think that'll be a good play. Um, yes, right around this time of day. The sticker is too long, but oh well. Okay, so I have my Zoom, I have a Zoom call. And then I don't have a like a a call on Thursday, but I have a reminder to myself that I want to keep. So I'm gonna put this little like push pin. Up there. And then we are out of town these three days here. So I do want to find a way to signify that. I'm thinking, what would be a good way? I wonder if I should go like real bold with the washi. <laughs> I haven't ever really done that for going out of town, but I think it could be kind of fun. Let's see if I can get some off of here. And then I'll layer some stickers on top of it, make that look pretty. Oh, this one's having that same issue as the other one with the edge being annoying. Put it here like so, or I could put it in the columns like so. Get my little cut tool. Pull this off a little. You guys are saying a highly technical, <laughs> a highly technical plan with me. <laughs> me trying not to lose my, you know what, while I work with this washi that's driving me crazy. Um, so yeah, this week is like kind of just that one appointment and then this big trip that we're taking to... North Carolina. I say big trip, like we've taken it many times before. It's and from our dang it, from our location, it's really not that far. But it feels like a big trip. Um, partly because 
I'm like super pregnant right now. <laughs> I mean, no, no, not near enough to my due date to like worry or anything, but just, you know, feel, I feel it in, in my bones for sure. Um, and, uh, and also because we haven't really taken a road trip with our daughter since she became kind of more of a toddler than an infant. So it's going to be like an interesting experience for us to do this um, with her and with me being being in my current state. <laughs> um, so, but you know what? Making time for friends and family is a big part of my life and this might be the last trip we take to go see them for a while because of course the baby's coming. Um, so, and it's, you know, her daughter's birthday. So it's an important occasion. It all lines up. It all lines up. And we haven't really gone anywhere in a while because we've been so absorbed with moving and settling in and stuff. So it might be nice to like take a little trip away from the house and all the things we think we have to do for it and stuff. Um, you know, just to kind of get out of our, our heads a little. So, okay. I know that looks a little strange, but I'm going to clean it up. <laughs> I'm going to clean this up a little bit. And then I'm going to come in with some stick eyes. And I'm not going to cover the very tops because that's where I'm going to put what's happening. I'm going to put the, the trip details up there. Um, for this particular trip, I'm not bringing my planner with me. So there really is no reason why I shouldn't cover up these days with washi. All right. And then I'm going to come in with some layered stickers. I think that looks kind of cute. It's kind of scrapbooky. Okay, so we are going to North Carolina and let's do some stickering. Okay, here we go. I really like this big old coffee mug thing. Cup of confidence. Send love. I kind of want it to feel a little scrapbooky, you know? Be bold. You have a bright future. It's kind of feels a little like fortune cookie-ish. <laughs> and this butterfly is really pretty. But I think I might put the butterfly elsewhere. Knowing yourself is the beginning of all wisdom. Reflect on your strengths and weaknesses. Knowing yourself is half the battle. I definitely know a lot more about myself now than I ever did. Than I ever did in... Um, well, for example, grad school. <laughs> it would have been nice to know more about myself then than I did than I did because I think that would have helped a lot with a variety of things let's put this little guy down here in the corner and I think I'm gonna need this like big old love yourself heart and this hand I know that's like a cluster of stickers I think we're going to keep it because I don't want to pull that up. And then we'll put that there. And I'm just going to check this page out real quick. Okay. 
We got these little shroomies. And I like the Strikes Magic sticker. Okay. And that's all the stickers. Okay. I like it. <laughs> it's a little funky. It's a little unusual, I would say, especially for my planning style. But you know what? I'm having fun. I'm on maternity leave. I can do what I want. Okay. Um, so let's bring some plans in here. So I have been putting the week number of my pregnancy. This will be week 31, I think. No looking. Okay, yes. Week 31. And this is January. I put the month up here because um, when I'm flipping through, you know, the, since it's undated and the months are in the front, it's just nice to know which like week this is and which month it is um, as I'm flipping through later when there's way more spreads to keep track of. Okay. And then for to do's. All right. So I will definitely need to place a grocery order, but a very, probably a very minimal one since we're going out of town and I need a birthday gift for the birthday girl. Um, I need to do some of that meeting prep. And I need to complete the survey. Okay, so that's everything I need to, that I know I need to do off of that. Let me just see. Okay, we also need to pack for the trip. Um, I'm looking at my January, and since you guys haven't seen that plan with me yet, I'm not showing it to you. <laughs> so that's what we're doing. The main thing this week is submitting the edited collection. I do have until the following Monday if I need it, but I'd love to get it off my plate before we go to North Carolina. So we'll see, we'll see if I do that. Get the survey. Um, and Okay, I think that is looking good. Um, so, whereas I have thought through how to use the monthly, like, space of infinite possibility, I haven't figured out yet about the weekly, um, like, this use of this space here. So, there are some things I want to be doing, some habits I want to form and keep track of and things like that. So maybe I'll put a couple of habit trackers out of here. Oh, I forgot I want to use some of these stickers too. I'm going to pop those in there just one second. Let me grab these guys. So we'll use this space primarily for this purpose. Okay. <clears throat> and um, I'm gonna drop those in real quick. So I would like to, and I would like to, take my vitamins. I skipped a day or two because <laughs> I've I'm just out of routine and I want to get better about flossing. So those three things I think are good. Um, and oh yeah those stickers that I wanted to use. Okay. <clears throat> Let's do that. Like these little like today I will do blank 
kind of like to-do list sort of, but you know. Oops, I kind of squished that sticker. Oh, well, I'm still gonna use it. Okay, I really like that. I think that just fills it out real nicely and gives me a space to jot some like things in. Um, super cute okay this turned out really nice I think let me know in the comments if you agree um, so yeah I think that's it for this coming weeks plan with me um, excited to go to North Carolina see my friend I really like the way this turned out here I just think that's kind of cool maybe I'll add a little washi at the bottom here since I don't need all these spaces for to do's next week um, in any case, thank you so much for watching this plan with me. Please um, give it a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe if you're not already. I do have some more fun 2024 planner videos coming your way. I'm really excited to share with you. So stay tuned and thanks for watching. Take good care. Bye.